Hello everybody, I'm Charlie Min, Editor-in-Chief of MotorPD.com. We recently opened this channel to reach out to you, global audience. So make sure you support us by subscribing to our channel. Thank you. So today we have Tesla's flagship sedan, Model S P100D. Many of you probably seen Model S, so I'll just jump right into the performance test. So let's use ludicrous plus mode for our test. First we need to select maximum battery power. Okay. Right now it's saying we need a minute uh, to warm up the battery and we need to keep on holding on this ludicrous plus icon for more than five seconds. And now we see the uh, warp effect going on on the uh, screen. We should be ready in a minute. Wow, it only took 3.3 seconds to reach 100 kilometers. That's insane. You won't find anything new from the side except this red calipers from Brembo's. Brakes are also impressive. Now we got the numbers out of the way. Let's go back to the city, Seoul. Last winter I had to chance drive Model S 90D and Every time I drive Model S, one thing that surprised me the most is how quiet this car is. I mean, this is probably the biggest slipper I get to drive. Wow. Jeez. <laughs> Steering feels a bit numb, but it's easy to point the car where you want to. We're on highway and still very comfortable and quiet in here, and it's very good at maintaining straight line on its own. Now let's try using the autopilot. I pull this lever twice towards you to activate the system. Once the system is activated, it's going to steer itself and then also keep a safe distance with the car in front. It's working very smoothly, but for your own safety, always keep your hand on the steering wheel. There are total 16 supercharging stations in Korea nationwide, including five in Seoul. But right now we're going to the one in Ilsan, which is about 30 minutes drive west from Seoul. But we're in, stuck in traffic. We arrived at the supercharging station. It's charging. We're gonna get some coffee. We had some coffee, charged the Tesla, and we're on the way back to Seoul again. And I just wanted to show you one more thing. While the autopilot is on, it will even change lanes for you. 
How cool is that? Now we arrived at the busy streets of Seoul. Let's see how Model S behave in the city. For that, I have to ask my friend for help. Hello, Alex. Hey, how's it going? Good to see you again. Uh, it's great to see you, and even better here. <laughs> I know. <This> is <laughs> so, did you buckle up? I, I always, man. This is like American style. You're always buckled as soon as you get in. Because we're in electric supercar. <laughs> yes. And um, <gasps> those buttons. Yes, it's those massive, right? Buttons. Seventeen inches. Dude, what can you? You can watch two movies <laughs> on this thing. <laughs> yes. And uh, would you like to say hello to our viewers first? Oh, sure. Hey, everyone. My name is Alex. I'm from the United States, and I live in Korea as a radio person, TV person, and a YouTuber. So, uh -huh. hey, if you want to say hi, check out my channel. It's Michin Alex, M-I-C-H-I-N. And if it doesn't make sense to you, it's because you don't speak Korean. <laughs> but, <laughs> yes, uh, but, yeah, this is amazing. This is so cool. Alex, Tesla is made in U.S., eh? Heck, and, yeah. Uh, from sunny California, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, I love Tesla. What do you um, think about the car? <sighs> this is my first time in a Tesla. Because mm -hmm. there aren't many Teslas in Korea. Not many. So either. I haven't had a chance to like be in a Tesla. Mm -hmm. And it is just, it's um, first impression. I mean, it better be for the price, but it's right. sleek. Like it is like, it feels smooth. The outside, I can even see the outside. It's right there. The outside is right on the screen. <laughs> like I can, I can look at the right. car and explain it to you. Right. But like even the way oh, I love these like how it's kind of metallic right next mm. to the mirror. Sculpted. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, the inside feels like you you paid about like the cost of college tuition. <laughs> like this is like. It, it cost about I told you. Uh, One hundred fifty. One hundred and fifty. That's college tuition. Yeah. That's three years of. That that's three years of Harvard. Mm. Down the but like I don't know if I'd say down the drain because if I could afford it. I, I would. I, I just, would you? Personally, I'm all about, you know, green energy. So, like, I want to buy an electric car. Mm -hmm. I am not far enough out of university yet to afford an electric car <laughs> of this price. Right. Um, but, no, I'm actually looking at a whole bunch of electric cars to purchase because... Oh, yourself, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, oh, man, like, if I had the money, mm -hmm. I would be looking up this high. But I, I, I don't have the money for this car. Like, this is a status thing, too. You've got to have money to have it. Like, right. you can't just take out a payment plan and get right. this. So, like, I I want an electric car. I believe that the future of transportation is going right. to be electric. And that's why, hmm. you know, I'm, I'm thrilled that Tesla and, you know, other companies are starting to step up and actually try to become a part of that. Um, so, I will, my first or second car will be a, electric an electric car. If it's not electric on my first one, it'll be a hybrid. But this is, whew. And you know, in, even in Korea, the Model S, I mean Model 3, yeah. the, the small one, yeah. it says it's going to be coming in two years. So uh, maybe that, that that's when I can afford it, yeah. More affordable, right? Yeah, so that's surprising. But I, I get it though. Um, so they're, because like it's a tough market to compete in because they've got some other Korean electric cars. Right. But I get why this one came first. Like this one, they're focused on it first. Because right. it's you like S-Class. <laughs> yeah, because Korea is yeah. about status. You don't right, right. you buy an expensive car because mm -hmm. you you show the person yeah. you are. And if you right. buy an electric car that's expensive, mm -hmm. you're saying I'm rich and eco-friendly as well. Eco yeah, yeah. So like you're kind of <laughs> that is your status symbol that you're portraying. Right. So I can see someone buying it in Korea. That makes sense actually. Mm -hmm. And Koreans and Koreans know all about you know. It's not like America where there's a debate. Koreans know global warming is right. a thing. You know, and we're this, hit by that heat wave, too. This summer is so hot. Yeah. Everyone, Something's wrong. I know. Yeah, there's all these non-electric cars out here. That's right. <laughs> These trucks that are burning diesel. I know. Yeah, we're going to change that, yeah. too, in Korea. Mm. Well, actually, this car is uh, Motor S, but this is P100D. Actually, and uh, what does that P mean? stands for performance. Okay. 100 stands for the battery pack. Uh huh. And D stands for dual motor, which is you know. <sighs> so when you put this, well, you don't buy P100. Wait, wait. What is that ludicrous? Uh, ludicrous. Ludicrous. We're in ludicrous mode right now. What does that mean? Let me show you. 
Why don't you put your head against the headrest? Yeah. Okay. Oh my God! Holy! 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 <laughs> oh! Oh! Yes. Oh! So you don't actually buy this car for oh. eco-friendliness, but what was that? So I've never. That's like a roller coaster. So. So I mean, <laughs> this is like a super sedan, you know, electric car. But plus, you can you get to say I'm eco-friendly. And I'm Puja too. Yeah. And I and you should date me because anyone who comes in this car be like, yeah, I'll marry you, Alex. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes, dude, that came out of nowhere. I just wanted to show you. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. I'm glad you did. There's that. And it's beautiful. Oh, I love I love how there's no sound in here. Like the car, mm. it's not even humming. It's like. Yes. I don't even know what to describe it as. It's like the wind noise and the the tire noise is. Yeah. That's all you hear. And it makes like the because this is a beautiful view. I don't know if the you, we have a camera on the front because this is cool. Mm. This is a great view. I I work around this here. One, yeah. Let me just ask you one more question. Sure. One, yeah. One, go for it. One question. Um, many people are saying there's lots of rumors that you know Tesla might go bankrupt. Mm. What do you think about that? Oh, I was reading today. That literally came out today. I don't know when this is coming out, but today. Um, there are talks about Tesla and a buyback and going private again. Right, right. Like there's a lot of talks going going on. Mm -hmm. um, I really hope they don't because mm -hmm. they need to, in my opinion, they need to succeed to show other companies that you can succeed by using an eco-friendly model as right. your way of making cars. Like mm -hmm. I want Tesla to see, succeed, not because I'm a Tesla fanboy. I'm not like a Tesla fanboy. I'm just a green energy like mm -hmm. fanboy. I want the world to go on, you know, solar powered, and right. I want the, you know, because you know what they're doing with the solar panels on the roof that look right. like a roof, and then it's like, right. then there's the the battery Making packs. Right. Like I want this whole ecosystem to work. Right. I want the cars to be powered by the sun, which is connected to your house, which mm. the battery in your house, like that's right. how you charge your car, Tesla, with a yeah with the solar roof. I, I don't want any of these like gas stations oh, to exist ever again. Like I don't right. want that. Um, so if Tesla, like Tesla just needs to, I, I, I'm cheering for them. I don't know what else to say. I know. I can't buy this car. Maybe I can buy the, the cheaper Model version. Model 3. Model yeah. 3 I can buy. I, I can't hope they bring it to the Korea soon too. Dude, please, by the way, bring it, call me. Remember that YouTube channel? I will, <laughs> I will promote, yes. I will promote that. Mm. You let me know. All right. Before we run out of the highway, let oh. me show you, um, this is this is autopilot. And what you're doing autopilot? Yeah. So they I'm have. Not, I didn't know they did autopilot in Korea. What is? I'm supposed to have my hands on the wheel, but uh, it even see. It that, does the lane changes for you. Yeah. How did that? Wait, do you just press the blinker and it? Yeah. Look. What if there's a car beside? Oh, then then it doesn't because oh. it's got all the sensors. So wait, wait, see? do it. So can you do so, that now? You go right. Lane. Okay. Yeah. Maybe it's sensing something, but uh, let me see. Okay, yeah. Oh, maybe because we're on a turn. We're on a... Okay. Yeah. Let me see. Okay. So what, you just spent one left. <gasps> see? And it steers itself and keeps a safe distance with the car in front. So, literally, I'm, I'm, this I'm is nervous. autonomous, autonomous I'm, driving, but... I've never been in autonomous driving. But oh, my God. Can I take a video? So <laughs> we are. Oh yeah, we so, have it right here. Supposedly, but you have to keep your, you know, hand. On yeah, the, of course. No, that's cool. That's uh, cool. I think you should. Uh, that's okay. I understand um, a lot of the reasons for that. Um, in the U.S., there was an accident where right, right. someone wasn't paying attention, right. and uh, it was a. They were testing it for one of the ride-sharing vehicles, mm -hmm. and the person wasn't paying attention. They hit somebody. Yes, yes. This is Hongdae. This is my playground. So now we're crossing Hongdae Busy Street. Right. Oh man, this is. All the young kids are out. Thank you so much for coming. Oh, dude. Oh, it's my pleasure, man. Oh, my pleasure, too. Uh, please come back to our show again. Uh, yeah. Yeah? Yo, you just, you tell me the next time you get a Tesla, you tell me the next time you get a I will be, why do you have other guests? Just get me. <laughs> okay. I think that's enough. We'll call you. Yeah. yeah. So, thank I'm you down. so much. Thank for, you, man. For your time, and uh, let's go have some dinner. I'm hungry. Absolutely, I'm starving. After ludicrous mode, I'm just starving. Yeah, yeah. I, well, I, <laughs> I let's go to a buffet. Let's just ludicrous yeah. out all night. <laughs> all right. Let's,
live a ludicrous life. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. We'll be back with more car reviews. See ya. And this is... <laughs> that is so smooth. Engine, so. Ooh, man, every taxi driver in Korea needs this because the taxi drivers are like, <laughs> boom, boom, boom. <laughs> this was so smooth. Every, this is, I'm, I'm speechless right now. So right now, there's nothing. No vibration, no sound. I know, I can hear too much of the cars on the outside because right, right. there's nothing here. Like, the inside, it's just... <laughs> Dude, it feels like one of those... Like one of those, I don't know, like airport trains that make no noise. Mm, right, right, right. That's what it feels like. <laughs> it's like a cell phone battery. You know, batteries are all stacked under Seriously? the car. And uh, it's like lithium ion thing. So it is like a, dude, we're, we're riding in a $150,000 cell phone. Yes, yeah. <laughs> and ludicrous, oh. with the ludicrous man. Yeah, well, that's ludicrous. <laughs> that was, that right. was, oh man, you're lucky I didn't curse on camera, I was about <laughs> yeah. to lose my sh <sighs> Even this speed, that Holy, speed. holy. <laughs> Just like. Well, the one bad thing is there's no. I know, I'm, trying to, grab, I'm trying to grab something. I'm like, there's what do no I grab? Oh, that was, Very nice. that was so fun. <laughs>